Hello there, welcome to my channel and this is your host Harsh and today video I am going to talk about growth hacking. Yesterday I published about a WordPress plugin called link status plugin. If you have not seen that, check out that plugin and the link is in the description. And today I am giving you two more tips on using that plugin. So this is not the exact purpose of the plugin but with this trick I am sure you can do a lot more with that plugin. So I will show you two quick things that you can do and it's pretty awesome. Especially it will help you in the search engine optimization and let's see what else we can do right. So one and the most important thing like you know I always wanted to see if I have a post from my own blog it is getting linked to like for example I have an old blog post which is getting internal links from 10 different places right. I want to check inter those internal links. Now with WP link status plugin it's pretty easy and let me show you how. So this is what you need to do you need to first run a full scan and then click on show results. And then in the search bar URL you will put any of your blog post link that you want to check the internal links for and click on filter results and it's here. Now in this case this is a blog post which I deleted but at the same time you can also check for the blog posts which are published. Now this is important in the case let's say you are doing blog auditing and you are deleting one of your blog posts right and you just wanted to quickly edit you know maybe two or three old posts to remove those links. Because when you remove the link sometimes the anchor text is different or maybe like you are linking out to uh, by writing hey check out my complete service. Now you want to get remove all the anchor text as well. So in that case this is important. Alright and now tell me the second one which is also pretty interesting. And this is useful for bloggers you know who have been blogging for a while. Now what happens like when we start out we usually link out to other blog posts with different keywords. After a while once we start understanding SEO once we start understanding the advantage of using anchor text and this is the time when we want to go back and update all our old posts but that is technically not possible. Now with this plugin you can do that. So let's say I am trying to rank for word WordPress. Now for the particular word WordPress I am trying to if I am trying to rank five different blog posts it does not make any sense. It has I can rank only one page or two page maximum and it's a good idea that the word WordPress should be linked to one particular blog post on your blog and this is what you can do. So in the anchor text we can search for word WordPress click on filter results and that's it. Now here, here we are getting all the result and let me see if we can find yeah so here uh, you know we have four options either mass string either full anchor I think full anchor is more useful you want to check like which all posts are linked from any particular word. So in this case you can see like I am making this long uh, this mistake of like you know my word wordpress has different target url which is not which is not a good idea like even I am trying to rank for this particular page it's my resource page called wordpress guide. So what I will be doing I will be copying this let's say let's do this edit url and that's it pretty easy right. So this is what this is pretty smart use of WP link status plugin. I have done a similar post last year in that post I showed you how you can use link patrol plugin to make money I mean that's also pretty interesting. I think you should check out that video also I have added the link in the description. Well for now only these two tips. In the coming days I'll be giving you more tips. You can like and subscribe to my channel for more such videos. This is Harsh. Bye bye.